welcome along everybody. This is going to be my guide for Weeping Woods. It looks like quite a big area to cover, but once you know where all the chests are, you can get around there quite quickly. It's not too bad of an area, and you can normally get out before the first storm. And there's lots of little ways you can get out, so I'll show you all them. I'm going to show you where all the chests are. They might not be there this guide, or they might not be there your game, but the location never changes because, as you know, at the Epic Games Christmas party when they were all drunk, they thought it'd be a good idea to start randomising the availability. And like I say, the location never changes. Well, hopefully the special chest will be there as well, so I can show you where that is. There's also an NPC there as well that you... She's, she's pretty hard to find. She kind of wanders around the woods a bit like Wolverine did. But if you can find her, you can buy a rift off her for 400 gold and she'll rift you so you can float to safety when you want to get out. But no, this is a nice little route around there. I'm not going to say it's the best route. I'm not going to say it's the fastest route. This is just the way that I go that I found most efficient. But you may decide to take little bits from it and choose your own route. It's completely up to you. Um, so I say thank you to the people that have subscribed and the people that are currently have been subscribed for a while. I appreciate it. I know I hit 200 subscribers yesterday. I know it's not loads, and I know it's not like some people have got. I know some people have got like half a million or a million subscribers, but I'm really happy to get 200 because I never thought I'd get to 100, let alone 200. So if I can make these little guides and they help people along the way, then I'm all I'm all for that and. I appreciate every single one of you for subscribing and commenting. Step Egg and Solar Storm regularly leaving comments and I appreciate it. So right, so without further ado, let's get going. My little bot account, say hello little bot. Um, I'll run around here as quick as possible. Hopefully we'll get a bit of favour. Most of the time you'll be alright from the first storm. As you know, if you land at the shark, most of the time you're going to be running from the first storm because it's so far out the way. But Weeping Woods is sort of central, so it's not too bad with the first storm. 8 out of 10 times you ain't going to have to move and even if, even if you have, do have to move it's, there's so many little ways if it's over near Slurpy Swamp you can just run it, it's not that far or near Holly Hedges you can just run it but no, it's a nice area to land and you can get a lot of mats and everything and weapons and good stuff so I'm just making sure thank you to Stepeg as well for the little comment about the um, and Solar Storm about the comment about turning copyrighted media off I know how to do it, I just keep forgetting to do it, but I appreciate you taking the time to leave the comment advising if I didn't know. Right, let's leave with my little bot. Let's go. Yeah, the NPC that gives you the rift, she, she's like bright blue, you cannot miss her. She's like a spectral NPC. There's two there. The one you want's the spectral one. And like I say, you can buy a little um, rift thing that she can pour you. It depends where the storm is, you know, if it's over near this way near Misty Meadows. Or retail row you can use a bear if it's over past the spire you can cut through the spire and use a zip lines or if it's over near holly hedge it's worth slurpy swamp you just run it right let's go we'll land on the special chest first of all because obviously it's a good weapon that's what you want to get it's the best way to start the game if i can find weeping woods where am i oh, over here a little bit confusing because it all looks the same where where is yeah sorry i kind of lost where i am then <laughs> That's a good guy, didn't he? He's lost where he is. Alright. Now, this spectral NPC, she, she's kind of hard to find, but if she is, she, I tend to find her wandering about the river, alongside the river. She doesn't stay in, the, stay in the same spot, so it can be a little bit hard to find her. So, just as you're gliding now, keep an eye out for the little icon, the little talk to icon, so you can see if she's here. That's why I'll always come across the river way. We're not going to land at the main building of Weeping Woods. We'll leave that. We'll come over to the little building where the special chest is first. Yeah, she's there. She's directly below me. See it on the mini-map? Right, come over to this little building first. And your first chest should be, or could be, on top of the chimney, which it is... I bodged up the landing a little bit. And the only thing about these guns is they slide off the roof. Now your next chest could be in here, on top of the bed. But again, because the weapons slide off the roof, you have to kind of slide off with them. Your next chest could be on this bed here. And just jump out the window come round into the little cellar. This is where your special chest will be here if it is, which it is. We've got a nice epic pump, sweet. Let me just reorganise. Don't worry if you don't get shield along here. What's that? Oh, we don't need it now, sort of pump. Little ammo box there. Right, as you're coming out of here, just take a little note if there's a chest there. There is it, just there. But we'll get that last, so don't worry about that now. Because we're going to be doing a full circle of Weeping Woods. I'm safe from the first storm, which is good. So I've got a bit of time to run around here. See what I mean? You're going to be alright from the first storm most of the time. 
Really? Let me just go and kill this, otherwise they're gonna annoy me and just keep shooting. didn't happen so pretend, just pretend that didn't happen <laughs> got to pick it up and pick these up I will grab it now actually because I'm here but I'd get that last but I'm just gonna grab it here because I have to get sidetracked by killing them what is that primal rifle let's take that I right, say so you can go faster than this I can see I'm safe from the first storm so I can sort of give a detailed guide let me just heal up Right, so we just come, imagine we just come out there. We've got the special chest, not this one, the one with the that's not always there. So that didn't happen just now. Right now we come along here. There's mushrooms along here that you can get your shield up and stuff, topping up as you're sort of coming over to the main building. There's some more, but I'm not going to spend the video collecting mushrooms. All around where I just was. Now we come over to the main building. Now we come through the bottom. And then now your first chest will be there. You'll know where you are because there was a Wolverine mark sort of on the wall there. Your next chest, if it is here, will be there. Other one above your head here. Let's get some spell on. Come up here. Sometimes there's a deep freeze, which there is, above your head here. Smash it through, it'll fall down. Now, come past this one, just listen out for a chest. I think it's here. Smash the wall through. Build some stairs. You don't have to build stairs, I'll just... just <laughs> you can just smash it through. There's your next one. Sometimes deep freeze there. Smash through the floor, there's your next chest. Their shield. Sometimes there's a deep freeze there as well. Now just come back into the corner and build some stairs. Now run up it. Next one will be in this room if it is here, which it is. Don't need minis. And just smash through the wall. There's your bears and that if you need to jump in a car to go to near Misty Meadows if you storm sort of over that way. Then just come up here. Your next chest will be in this first one here, right in between these boxes. And just jump back over the roof. Your next chest will be here. Smash this through, you'll fall on top of it. Also another chest through here. These walls are going to be a pain in the arse, aren't they? Right, ignore him. I hope there's just one. Right, you can buy... Oh, wait, wait, no, 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 sorry, I've missed it because I got sidetracked with that wolf. As you come through that one there, come around here. There's sometimes two chests, one here. And one above your head here. Sorry, I forgot, it's because I got sidetracked with that wolf. There's your other one. Oh, come out here, grab the metal. Now there's not one in here, so don't worry about it. Sometimes there's one over in the middle, which there is. So we're going to grab that. Now I come over to these caravans. Sometimes they're here, sometimes they're not. But they're always good to smash up anyway. It'll be in this one here if it is, but it's not. But they're always good to smash up to get your mats up, your metal up. So you're not just relying on wood. And also to get your mechanical parts. I'm not going to smash them all up, because I don't need to upgrade anything. But if you need to upgrade, just smash all these up. Get all your mechanical parts and then do any upgrading you need to do. Like I say, if you've got a bit of time like I have, you could just go around here now just farming loads of stuff. And this is it's sort of a big circle, do you know what I mean? And you can normally be quite safe from the first storm. Go for it, grab the other chest. Straight over here. Now as you come up here, there's some more mushrooms. If you need to top up on your um, shield, like a little pit stop, just 
just to get a little bit of shield. There's some here that... Oh, I've just run over one. Bang. You get the idea. <laughs> I don't need to explain it. But there you go, some mushrooms around there. Now we jump on the zip line. Now that chest that I went back for that was going to leave, you stay on the zip line all the way to there, but you don't have to. I don't have to now, but you'd stay on the zip line to there. But just come up here, jump off on this tree. If, it, if it's not there, jump off on the tree. Jump off on the roof. Sometimes there's some chests in here. Are they here? Not always, but sometimes there is. They're not here. So then just come out, come straight up the cliff. Now if you haven't got an epic rifle, you can grab one off this spire woman here. Sometimes there's a chest up here, which there is. There it is. Let's go and find the spire. Rest in peace. There she is. Oh, that was a bit... So if you haven't got an epic rifle, there you go, there's your an epic rifle. And then just come all the way up to the top. And then you can just ping. If you're really good, you can actually... I haven't done it yet. It's a bit of a pain. Be careful not to hit the trees. As you... It's a bit of a pain. You hit the... Another bow if you want it. Sometimes there's a chest here. Sometimes there's two. Sometimes there's one. It just depends on your luck. And if you're really good, you can actually ping on this and catch the zip line as well. I haven't done it yet. <laughs> and that's you. You've cleaned out Weeping Woods. There's a drop over there, but it's going to be random for your game. Now as I'm running around there, we'll see if we can find this spectral NPC. Like I say, she's a bit of a pain to find. She just kind of wanders around like an old person that's a bit lost. But you you can't miss her. She just she's like I say, she's bright spectral blue. But I'm not sure I'm not sure of her of of her um radius. Of the only times I see her is around near this uh, around near the um, the riverbed sort of thing but I'm not sure how far she actually wanders around here she was here because I saw her as I was flying over on the um, when I was gliding down for the first sort of go more mushrooms there if you need them if she's not here don't worry too much but I just want to show you one more little thing that I do when I'm here I don't need her anyway because I'm quite safe in the storm but I want to show you another little thing that I do while I'm here. Alright, we'll leave him, I can't bother. No, we won't, we're going to kill him. Where's he gone? Come back. Right. Now, if, you've got, if you're in Weeping Woods and you've got a lot of time to spare, not a lot of people realise this. This is why I just want to quickly show you this while I'm sort of... Yeah, there's another chest in there. We'll just go down the river, because it's quicker. I've got to go that way for the storm anyway, so that ain't too bad. But like I say, as you can see, I've gone round there, look at the weapons I've got. I know one of them was from a rare chest, but the more chests you loot, the more... Wait there, this one's going to shoot me. The more chests you loot, the more likely you are to get one of them, come across one of them special chests. That's why it's good to check the hole. Is the storm moving? Oh, we're not going to have time. But anyway, we're not going to have time because the storm's moving. I ain't even moving that far. Oh no, terrible. I should have left the video there. Come on, how many times do I need to shoot her with a fucking epic pump for her to die? <laughs> But yeah, there's a little, as you, uh, when I get to safety, I'll show you, as you come, where near where I've got the first chest, you know, well, not the first chest, but you know the special sort of rare chest, just to the left of there, there's two little burger faces, like the tomato head faces, and they look all rusted up and everything, and you can get about 160 metal from them, and they, they bash up so quickly, and it's 160 metal, and I'd only go for them if you've kind of got a lot of time to spend, do you know what I mean, and you ain't got to rush that much. I'll just let him shoot. Right, as I'm coming here, as you've landed, sort of here, just over to the left here, around about here, there's two little burger heads, or tomato heads, and you kill them. There's two, 
there's two little burger heads you smash them up and get 160 metal and it's it takes two seconds and it gets your mass up nice so there we go we've been around weep, weeping woods we've got a nice pump shotgun we could have if we got a blue one we could have upgraded it using the caravans a nice legendary primal rifle but if i didn't get that i could have got the epic rifle from that spire assassin that was there um nice primal flame bow and also you saw another bow drop there i think it was a dynamite one an epic dynamite one full sh uh, free shields maximum shields med kits quite a few mats and you are good to go you're in a good position anyways i hope you find that guide useful if you do feel free to like and subscribe and i hope you're having a great start to the season and everything's you're finding it i'm finding it a little bit tricky without a sniper rifle but i'm having a lot of fun with a shock bow <laughs> I love it. Anyways, all the best. Thank you for watching. Feel free to like and subscribe. And again, thank you to the people that have subscribed and the people that have stayed subscribed. I really appreciate it. All the best. Take care and I hope you have a wonderful week.